Tonight, I have a picturesque story in which James Bell can bask in the glory. But is it glory or maybe a curse? I'll tell it you now in couplets and verse. He received one day a picture from his fiancée. It was an owl on a town. <laughs> he replied with a goat on a boat. That begat a cat on a mat. He then shared a chair on a bear. She, dog on a log. He, fish on a dish. This game via email was all that it took for James to share it on the frigging Facebook. <laughs> he asked, My question to you, O oh Facebook, is whether anyone has a real life unstaged photo of a weasel at an easel. <laughs> James sat there aghast. The images came, they came thick and fast. Animals on things was clearly a blast. A duck on a truck, a frog on a bog, a snail on tail, a snail on a nail, a toad on a road, a fox on a box, a ram on a dam, a shark in the dark, a snake on a cake, cake on fish cake, a seal on a wheel, flies on pies. He got the weasel at an easel, and a weasel that had been on an easel, and an easel at cat weasel, and a beagle on an eagle. A mole in a hole, a mole with some coal, a buck on a truck, not a stag on a wagon, a dragon on a wagon, an enamel camel. Some were so clear, devoid of descriptions, as it evolved, what were the constrictions? Were we actually allowed illustrations? The twists and the turns not without their frustrations. One thing James made clear to some who failed to hear, you don't get any points for simply rhyming an animal with an object. <laughs> Pictures or it didn't happen. <laughs> Some people's efforts were just plain half-arsed, whilst pure found photos were top of the class. Photoshop had its turn to turn up the juice with scenes that seemed lifted from a Dr. Seuss, like the moose in the caboose with the noose for a goose. A sloth on a goth. Beaker and a sneaker. Signori <laughs> Weaver on a beaver. A beaver with a cleaver. <laughs> the posts carried on. They soon passed a hundred. My inbox is full, somebody thundered. Thanks for the tag. Someone had blundered. Pictures to the right of them. Pictures to the left of them. Pictures in front of them. Into the gallery of death. The posts passed two hundred. <laughs> a horse on a course. A foal on a goal. A zippo and a hippo. A quoll on a knoll. A macaw on the floor. A Labrador on the floor. Skunk on a trunk. A tiger up the eiger. A cow with a bow. A cow with a plow. An exolotl in a bottle. A riders in pyjamas. A skink in the sink. Sheep in a jeep. A scarf on a giraffe. A giraffe on a raft. A pig with a fig. A wig on a pig. A a pug in a mug, a dog in the bog, a great Dane on a plane, a collie under a brolly, a bitch in the ditch and a keeter with a heater, a spaniel on a manual, a bullfrog on a bulldog, <laughs> a hedgehog with a hot dog. <laughs> the obvious kept coming, yet some were more tricky, some just mundane, others more witty. The judge was called for at difficult times. The response was, I'm sorry, we take no half rhymes. <laughs> no, with a phone, out you go. Owl on my gal, that's question about. A, a seagull on an eagle. Ferret with a beret, or is that a ferret with a beret? <laughs> Santa Fe's manta rays was a little bit strange. Ants and pants. Elephants in pants. My usual abuse of English was pants. Despite my continual hints, it took them some time <laughs> to get elephants Pence in chintz. Jesus, Louises. <laughs> Most were so simple, some made us think. With the next one you're missing, you've got us all guessing. Is it a godzuki on a bazooki or an armadillo on a cello? No, it's a pangolin on a mandolin. <laughs> we did get the armadillo on a pillow. A carp and a half, a hat on a rat, 
a germ on a worm, a crocodile in the Nile, a croc in the dock, a vole in a bowl, a shrew on a tattoo, a cockatoo on a tattoo too, a bird on a word, an arrow in a sparrow, a turn with a fern, a turn shitting on a tax return, <laughs> ducks on gloves, a kia with a skier, a drake on a lake, a cock on a clock, a coot on a root, a lark in the park, a parrot holding a carrot, a carrot carved into a parrot, an owl with an irritable bowel, or irritable owl syndrome, FUCK OFF! <laughs> a flamingo and a dingo playing bingo, a chimpanzee taking tea on James CD, joy and jealousy, that was me, a cat with a bat on a mat, then the post hit 300, did we need more? What, only three? We soon went past four. The cast of curious creatures, it just grew and grew. People are animals, there were quite a few of them too. We had a nun with a gun and a nun with a bun. Or was it a nun and a habit with a bunny rabbit? Josh Hall on a ball, my daughter on the water. An arrow in Jack Sparrow. Barack Obama with a farmer, <laughs> a farmer, <laughs> the Dalai Lama in Banana Rama, <laughs> <laughs> a banana with an iguana, a ghost on toast, Ringo Starr in a car, not Vinny in a Mini or Ringo in a Peugeot, Mark Ruffalo beside a Gruffalo, <laughs> the latter told more effort please, a picture beside a picture that's just a breeze. And manga poo beside a kangaroo? Get to the back of the queue. <laughs> the week wore on. We wondered what this game's fate is. The game was now run by some top procrastinators. <laughs> Late in the night, over a keyboard, our finger twitches. We were tracking down more pure, untainted pictures. A kitten in a mitten. A hoo-hoo grub down the pub. A lemur on a dreamer, a lemur with a femur, a baboon with a bassoon, a raccoon with a spoon, a rhino on lino, a rabbit in a habit, a hornet on a corner, a yeti with spaghetti, a bee on a key, a bee in a tree, a louse on a mouse, twice, a flea <laughs> on page three, a bullock on a hillock, a monster with a lobster, a mule by the pool, a yak with sacks, or is he a yak on the track, a pine martin with a tartan? A face on a place, oh a water bear <laughs> on a chair, bears on the stairs. There were many suggestions and lots of requests, and here I would share with you some of the best. An armadillo with a cigarillo, a panda on a sander, a mosquito and a mojito, a squirrel on the rural, a stoke in a boat, a crane on the drain, a bison with a dyson. <laughs> <laughs> we had now just hit the 500th post. James called a stop. Of this he could boast. My brain was still spinning. It just couldn't rest. I needed one more to be put to the test. So I hit the printer, got my scissors and glue. Old school, that's me. I'll show them who's who. Instead of that bison, you see, I thought there's no flies on me. I concocted J. Edgar Hoover on bison manoeuvres. Die, you damn stupid beast! Just roll over and die, damn you! The game had gone mental. <laughs> it went on for an age. James nearly called Zuckerman for its own separate page. <laughs> James finally called for the requiem of a man. One day we may go back home where the buffalo roam and the deer on the pear and the antelope on a poke <laughs> <laughs> and we can hunt for that elusive sweet sparrow on a bat. <laughs> <laughs>